What up, Rare fans? Jonathan here with Ocean Guardian, and I'm with Scott, and we've got some researched backed products that we're going to talk to you about today. And all this research was done from the movie Jaws, right? <laughs> no. <I'm... laughs> So I want to go through and talk about the products that we sure. particularly carry at Florida Freedivers. Uh, which, do you have a preference on which one you want to start with? I'll probably start with the Freedom 7. Okay. So this is our Freedom 7. So this is the most popular for spear fishing, scuba diving, whether you're spe uh, spearing on freediving or spearing with scuba. Okay. Um, so the Freedom 7 works with two electrodes in the antenna. So we mount the Freedom 7 on your ankle and we have one electrode here and another one on the end. And basically we're pulsing between those two electrodes and it sets up a field 10 to 15 feet uh, around you. Okay. So that's what protects you from uh, sharks. So it affects the sharks and kills Lorazzini um, and keeps them that distance away from you. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. So, so when I wear this on my ankle, and this is one of the questions that we get asked a lot, right? Um, I'll never see sharks, right? And obviously you mentioned that 10 to 15 foot Correct. distance. So will they ever come closer than that 10 to 15 they can do foot? sure um so the radius is around the actual antenna itself mm -hmm. so you obviously have this on the back of your foot so that's more trailing behind you so you need to be aware of that okay. um so if you've got a fish you're holding it to your chest you want to um, be aware of where your um, antenna is because sharks will continuously circle within that perimeter and they will try and penetrate that barrier. Sure. So any weakness in that barrier, um, they will try and uh, take advantage of it and get right. your fish. Right, right. Yeah. It's the tax man, right? Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. And we've all experienced that if you've done any length of spear fishing. Yeah. Um, so as we mentioned kind of in our last video though, that this is highly, highly scientifically backed, that it's not just like me and my buddies went and did this one yep. time. It's an independent research too. Like you it guys is. didn't actually do the published research. That's correct. We have not published any, or we have done no research other than product research. Right. Uh, it was done by the Natel Sharks Board in South Africa originally, so the waveform and the form factor. Um, we have developed product around that, and we've always kept it the same, waveform, everything like that, okay. power output. So we know that works. Um, the testing has been done by multiple universities in Australia. Uh, the French have done it, um, South Africa, oh. University of Pretoria. So we have multiple research. Um, and that's where we say, we can safely, easily say that we're scientifically uh, yeah, proven right. and independently tested. Wow, that's really cool. Yeah. Um, so as far as the practical side, mm -hmm. right? Like as me as a free diver and a spear fisherman, um, you know, having this, how long is this tail? This one is six feet. Six feet. So yep. having that like six foot length of tail behind me, sure. um, I feel like that might kind of get a little bit cumbersome or tangled around the reef or wrecks or anything like that. I mean. How does that play to what you guys have seen real sure. well? So this is, is developed to be neutrally buoyant in the water. Okay. So you don't really feel it on your ankle, mm -hmm. um, particularly if you're wearing a wetsuit. So you won't feel it on your ankle. When you're actually finning or moving through the water, if you have uh, any direction momentum behind you, it will trail behind you. Uh, you won't really notice it's there unless you stop or you have a current push it back onto you. Okay. And that's where people will say they get zapped by it. Okay. So you can feel the, um, the, the feeling current coming from Interesting. it. So start putting your hand closer to the electrode, the first electrode, mm -hmm. and you will feel it pulsing. So this is the feel we have to have enough power to be able to sure. keep sharks at bay. Sure. Um, if it's too low, they'll get closer and people will complain. So it's that balance between power output and okay. also being able to protect you and your catch. So if when I if it actually touches me, how mm -hmm. bad of a zap are we talking? We're talking like getting tased underwater? It's not a taser. Or? No, okay. it's not a taser. <laughs> so have you ever had those TENS machines they put on you at the DEMA and stuff like that where they make your muscles uh -huh. twitch? Yeah, so okay. like that. So okay, interesting. you will feel the muscles in your hand twitching. So. It's not, uh, it's not going to affect you it's, it, from the perspective of your health. There's a lot of research being done. The Natel Sharks Board spent two and a half million dollars on health research, wow. for divers, things like that, wow. to see how it would penetrate the body and affect people. So we don't. Remember, it doesn't do any of that. It does not. No. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Cool. No long term effects. Uh, very cool. Yeah. So and then like moving through the water and everything like that, totally good to go. It is. Yep. Obviously, you. you know, we want to protect the marine environment. So if you're in coral reef, things like that, then it'll be very cautious of how you're actually doing that. We don't want to damage right. the environment, so that's right. uh, the main thing there. Some people will actually 
pull it up to them if they're going through that, but generally it'll just trail and glide behind you. Very cool. Talking a little bit about the, the battery life and kind of how it works, uh, does it change batteries or recharge sure. or how does that work? Yeah. So it's a lithium ion battery um, in this unit here. So we recharge it, we have two pins on okay. here, so it just recharges externally. So the battery life is seven hours. Okay. Uh, you get a thousand charge and discharge cycles on the unit. Oh, wow. So we get people lasting seven, eight, ten years. Wow. Um, you will also get an audible sound um, okay. once the battery's going for that last 10% of the power in the unit. So you can know either to exit the water or if you're feeling safe, you can continue spearing anything like cool. that. So yeah, it gives you Sounds a nice good. option. Any other parts or pieces that I need to like change as a user or anything like that? No, we do get, so, so we have a Velcro pouch. So this is what goes around your ankle. So mm -hmm. some people over time, you can they wear, that you out. Can wear yeah. it out. So we have replacements available through the store here. Um, switches as well we can replace those okay um, that's really about the only but this, uh, this cord never goes bad or anything like the that. cord doesn't um, it doesn't lack propellers okay um, so okay. neither yeah. do I so, yeah so that's, fair. Um, that, that's the thing we have a, a 12 month warranty we also okay. have a 30 day uh, money back guarantee so okay. if someone purchases one in the store and they don't like it for some reason um, then they can return it to you and okay. we'll give them a full refund nice so Nice, very yeah. cool. Um, so yeah, I think that's, we've actually sold quite a few of those and we have customers who come back raving about them, uh, saying that they absolutely love them. And like we kind of talked off camera, it really just is this, this peace of mind that is being sold with this product that just so happens to be backed up by science, which is kind of nice. That it's not just this placebo effect, it's actually, uh, you know, really is working. Um, so another new product that you guys have brought to the market, or not yet brought to the market, right? It's coming out this month. Coming so out this yeah, month. Okay. So by the time that yeah. this video is hitting, you guys will be able to buy this. Um, so tell me a little bit about this guy. Yep. So this guy is, uh, an, I guess it's our entry level uh, electronic shark deterrent. Okay. So we had a lot of people saying, okay, we don't see a lot of sharks, so we don't necessarily want to use this one all the time. Um, but they felt like they wanted to have that peace of mind that if a shark did come around them, you know, you see the videos of guys prodding sharks yep. with a spear and they can't get them away. Right. Well, this unit is called the e-spear. Um, so it just attaches to you. We have a pouch available as an option, or you can put it wherever you are on your mm -hmm. diet gear. Um, and it's non-operated in this situation. And then when you're in water, if you have a shark come around trying to get your catch or just being a little too inquisitive, you basically do this, it opens out. And then once it opens, it will then know it's in seawater and it'll turn on automatically. Hmm. So then similar to this unit, we have two electrodes here and it pulses between them, creates a smaller field than the Freedom 7. Sure, smaller it's, unit, right? Yeah, but it's enough to keep a shark at bay and so tell like them. So like five feet? It's around five to 10 feet. Five to yep. 10 feet, okay, yep. cool. So Which is still more than I would want. I mean, that's you know, it's far enough away from me. Yep. I can see what they're doing, but they're not gonna be Absolutely. trying to take my fish from yep. my body. Yeah, cool. yep. And it gives you the opportunity to get out of the water with your fish. Right. And, uh, get back so is this, it's, I assume it's directional, right? So you do kind of want to aim it's, it to the it's, shark? It's or? basically a field, it's an elliptical field like all of our products. So yeah, okay. you want to keep it between you and the shark. Okay. Um, that would be the way. But it's not like a taser, I can't like tase my buddies with it in the underwater. No, you can't. <laughs> okay. We, we okay. never so recommend that. Don't ever, drag, <laughs> don't ever drag your antenna over your buddy. Yeah, um, so enough. you won't get invited back on the boat. <laughs> yeah. Fair enough. So I guess the big thing to know about this product is it's, it's a deterrent, it's a safety device like all of our devices. Um, same as the Freedom 7, we always recommend people to have it turned on. So get in mm -hmm. the water, turn it on, and make sure you turn it on before you exit right. out of the water into the boat. Right. Because um, more than 60% of shark bites, the person did not see it coming. Mm -hmm. So this is, I guess, what we need to know about this one is right. that, okay, you need to be able to see the shark to be able to use right. it as a product. Right. So that's so, yeah, you're only in the 40% chance if that's the case. Yeah, sure. Um, yep. So interesting. And then uh, how, as far as batteries and oh. lifeline and how yep. does that work? So this one, again, it's rechargeable, it's fully okay. electronics. So we have a docking station. It just sits on the docking station and recharges. Uh, the battery mm -hmm. life on this one is two hours. Okay. Now, when I say two hours, that's two hours operation. Okay. Right. So it can, you know, be that's like this for, This is unoperational, so right. it's, it can be like this for a week. When you operate it, then you have get two, two hours. hours. If you take two hours to get back on the boat, you're lost. Yeah, fair right? enough. <laughs> fair enough. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay, cool. And how long does it take to recharge? About? Uh, this, this one's six hours to recharge. Six hours. Okay. It takes a lot longer than the Freedom 7 just because it's an inductive sensor. Mm -hmm. So, typically, you 
we'll put it on overnight and night yeah, or something yeah. like that. Yeah. Uh, and then about how many cycles you think? Again, it's a thousand, thousand charge cycles. and discharge cycle. Wow. Yep. Very good. Yeah. So many um, years of operation. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. Awesome. So that's the eSphere. It is. Um, and then we've got one last product, right? Sure. So the eSphere and the boating product is, uh, these are the new products we're coming out with. So, and again, as you mentioned before in the previous video, is uh, Ocean Guardian are offering peace of mind. Mm -hmm. That's what we're, our company is about uh, and protecting marine animals. So we totally believe that humans and shark species can live in harmony together absolutely um, and by reducing shark bite things like that we get rid of the the negative connotations yeah. around sharks uh, because they're, they're needed um, so this is the uh, boat products that's the boat 01 uh, so similar to all of our other products we have a transducer and with this one we have different antennas which basically mount to the bottom of the buoy okay. and create a field uh, in this case, we call it a safe swimming area that you can have for your kids, your family, off the back of your boat. And the radius on this one is 20 feet to 30 oh. feet. Wow. Yeah, so, so much bigger. Larger. It is. So yeah. does that mean that it's pulsing at a stronger current? That's correct. Yeah. Okay. So the electrodes are larger, uh, further apart, mm -hmm. and pulsing at a different A little rates. bit stronger. Yep. Yeah. Sure. Yep. So this guy effectively just gets put in the water and turned on it and does. that's it. Yeah, not so it's, much to it. You can actually power it directly from the boat if you like. Oh, and wow. It comes with cables that plug into your um, power uh, or it has a 12 hour battery life. Okay. Um, so it couldn't be just floating around the back. Obviously right. you want it anchored to your boat so you don't right. lose it. <laughs> right. Um, right. But yeah, it's, a, it's great. We're getting oh, a lot cool. of interest in it. Um, very cool. Well, super exciting to yeah. have all these cool things. And if you guys did want to get any of these products, we will have all of this stuff available here in the store. Uh, these two guys will be available on our website, so you guys can always check that out at floridafreedivers.com. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and uh, if you guys do have someone who's absolutely terrified of sharks, and they need to see this video, just share this with them so they can realize that sharks are not always out there to come get us, right? Prior to what shark week, like you think. Um, but, uh, but this is something that's cool. We can actually swim and interact with sharks in a safe manner, and do so with uh, a little bit more peace of mind. So exciting that uh, Shark Shield and Ocean Guardian have kind of created this stuff for us to do that. Um, so, all right guys, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you. Thank you guys so much for watching our video. If you guys did find value in this content, please be sure to smash the like button. And if you guys have any questions on any of the content that you saw in this video or any of our other videos, be sure to leave a comment and we try to answer those as soon as we can. Also, any of the products that you guys did see in this video, you can always check out on our website at flfreedivers.com. See you in the next one.